Hello user, today we will talk about the JavaScript blob. The image get downloaded in the encrypted and uh, rendered in the DOM. Uh, in the DOM once rendered uh, that encrypted format of the image, uh, so it will DOM, it will automatic convert to the decrypt and it will render. So we'll check the example. So I already written the code uh, to go fetch the image uh, this is a throttle image I created a uh, one of uh, here so and then uh, after that uh, index.html I created one button and uh, the image source should be rendered here instead of uh, calling to instead of doing this right uh, like uh, throttle.jpg instead of doing this see if you do see here it is rendered so instead of doing that so we will uh, add encrypted uh, blob image url and render to in the dump this uh, element so this is a js file so when the button is clicked uh, so added the function is a button click so here it is fetch uh, image uh, so here added that uh, async and await to wait wait uh, to download the image from this url okay this is an actual url you can add any type of the url like uh, a different origin or uh, whatever so then it is returning a promise the promise we have to return to the blob method so then after that uh, so create a url create object url so after uh, object url uh, like um, uh, uh what is that uh, after our object url we have to pass that uh, encrypted blob url to the uh, render into the image source so this is the one so if you go to the browser so if you click on this one see here it will render to with a different url with the blob http the source so this is an encrypted one uh, the uuid code so each time if you click it will generate with a new one see here it is generated new one this is the one and this is the one if you check in the console the blob it is printing to here right yeah in this blob what it is returning you can debug uh, here in the console and check when we click on this see you can check the size and image uh, type is the image jpg then after that it uh, whatever the blob is coming from that uh, fetch method it will create it so create object url like uh, this one See, this is created right so this url we are added to into the image source that's it in this video so previously uh, for the web worker we used uh, how we can communicate one application to the another application uh, with the js file uh, so there we add added uh, the how the uh, js file is downloaded into the in another application so that's why i added in this video so that's it if you have any query please write the comment in this video thank you